so, where is that mysterious box? Right there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and then just suddenly appeared. Yes, it did. Yesterday it wasn't there. And all doors and windows were closed. Mm. Look, there's something written. Could you mind something? Yes, Erwin Schrödinger. He had the same problem. He imagined a cat in a box and asked, dead or alive? He wanted to explain quantum mechanics with it. In that situation, the cat would be dead and alive at the same time, just because we don't know what it is at the end. Stupid. This, my friend, is called quantum mechanics. That is that with what Evan Schrödinger worked on. In the 19th century, then, when he lived, no one could explain that. It was too complicated. How can be particles, in the mathematic term, at the same time, everywhere? It is impossible. But everyone knows that a thing can't be both at the same time. In our situation, a cat can't be dead in a life. But, so long as we don't know it, it is both. We only can know it in the precise way when we do it. When we measure it in real life. So... Ah shit! It's empty! Never heard of that at the end of every good movie must be an explosion? Oh shit! RUN! Can you explain me how an empty box could explode? Well, I have no idea, but we are going to find it out. This way. Don't you have that feeling that nothing here makes any sense? Well, George, this is called quantum mechanics. <laughs>